as part of activities to celebrate the International Day of the Girl Child, UNICEF Gambia, Women Boss and UNDP on Saturday organized a day-long stakeholder engagement at the Sadaura Kerabaja International Conference Center in Bijilo to amplify voices of girls and women. The event brought together young girls from across the country to discuss issues important to them, including education, violence and online harassment. The International Day of the Girl Child is celebrated on October 11th each year to recognize girls' achievements and raise awareness of challenges they face. UNICEF Country Deputy Representative emphasized the importance of the theme and addressed some of the challenges girls face in the Gambia. The girls in the Gambia, like in many other countries in the region, are struggling every day to have a better life. And the number of bottlenecks that you see, the number of obstacles that you face, the number of harmful practices or challenges that you face every day must not discourage you in doing your best to be the present and the future of the nation. Among these obstacles, we have gender-based violence, early marriage, early pregnancies, but also FGM and other gender-based violences which may impede you in your ambition to be part of the leaders in this country. But today let's celebrate also hope. Let's celebrate your talent. Because as leaders, when the government invests in education, for example, but also in other social, I mean, other basic services, and give you the opportunity to act at leaders, as leaders, you must be able to show, to amplify all what you are doing, all what you are saying, so that the girls you represent who are across the country know what's happening. Speaking on behalf of the UNDP resident representative, Fatima Sonko highlighted the importance of investing in girls' rights. Empowering girls and investing in their rights and well-being is not just the right thing to do. It is a strategic imperative for the development of any society, the Gambia included. When we support girls, we invest in the future. We nurture leaders, innovators, and change makers. We pave the way for stronger, more equitable communities. The UNDP remains firmly committed to the empowerment of girls and women, as well as the promotion of gender equality. We will continue our efforts to empower women with the aim of increasing their representation in leadership positions and decision-making processes at all levels. Fatuge, a senior legal officer at the National Human Rights Commission, discourses the difficulties encountered by girls in rural Gambia. In fact, we have made some progress, but there are still challenges. Rural girls continue to face considerable challenges with regards to FGMC, early child marriage, gender-based violence, right to nationality, right to health, right to education, and so many other rights. So it is this time that we can come together, partner, put our ideas together, and then come up with a comprehensive recommendations in which we can share with other partners as well. Latisa Grant, a woman boss ambassador, discusses the importance of supporting and empowering girls in the Gambia. Girls don't need voices. They already have voices. So if you can please listen to them with intention, it will be good. It will make the place a better, conducive environment for everybody. Since 2011, there has been a global movement to recognize the unique challenges and rights of girls around the world. This year's theme, investing in girls' rights, our leadership, our well-being, emphasizes the importance of investing in girls' 
to ensure that they can reach their full potentials. Reporting for Kefato, I am Ramatlajao.